Hey there, Ryan here. If you've ever been frustrated by that pesky carrier lock on your phone, you're not alone. I know the feeling of wanting to switch networks, but being held back by a locked device. That's why today, I'm super excited to guide you through unlocking your Republic wireless phone. And guess what? These tricks aren't just for Republic wireless. They're universal, so you can break free from any carrier's grip anywhere in the world, whether you're Team Android or an iPhone lover. We've all been there, right? Finding that perfect phone plan, only to discover our phone is tied to another network. It's like being handed the keys to a shiny new car, but the doors are locked. Not anymore. In this ultimate guide, we're tackling that frustrating carrier lock, ensuring you can hop onto any network you fancy, hassle-free. So grab your phone and let's get started. It's time to unlock new possibilities. Let's keep it clear and simple. This guide is for you if you own your phone and simply want to change carriers. We're not about encouraging any wrong moves, like tampering with stolen devices. Always respect the law and the rights of others. And of course, everything we do here is in line with YouTube's guidelines and community standards. Now that we've got that straight, let's get back to it. Remember, the unlocking services we're discussing are usually for first world countries. If these services aren't an option for you, or if you'd rather not use them, we've got you covered. We offer 250 unlocks every week for our viewers. To be part of this, just like this video, and subscribe to our channel. Lastly, comment your phone model, for example, Samsung S22, your IME number, and your country. Complete these steps, and you're automatically entered for a chance at a free unlock. It's that straightforward, so don't miss out. To get started with Carrier Switcher, simply navigate to CarrierSwitcher.com and hit the green button. This takes you straight to the online Carrier Unlocker app. Once you're there, you'll need to enter your name and email to kick things off. Make sure to use a valid email address, as you'll receive a confirmation code there. After your details are in, you'll pick the manufacturer of your device, like Samsung or Apple. The next step is crucial, entering your IMEI. For those unfamiliar, you can find your IMEI by dialing star hashtag 06 hashtag on your phone's keypad. This code works for most modern phones and will display your IMEI instantly. With your IMEI entered, take a moment to confirm that you're following the terms of service and not attempting to unlock stolen property. Once you've confirmed, go ahead and tap continue to wrap up the process. You'll notice that your unlock is now ready and a confirmation email is winging its way to you. This email is pretty important. It contains further instructions and an access key. This key isn't a one hit wonder. You can use it multiple times for unlimited downloads. To make the most of your access key, follow the steps outlined in the page linked in your confirmation email. And there you have it. That's how you navigate the carrier switcher to unlock your device. Stay tuned for what comes next. If you're looking for alternative ways to legally and ethically remove the carrier lock from your phone, there are a few options you can consider. One of the most straightforward methods is reaching out directly to your carrier. Most carriers will unlock your phone for free if you've completed your contract or paid off your phone in full. It's as simple as making a phone call or sending a request through their website. They might ask for some details like your account information and the IMEI number of your device. But once that's sorted, they'll provide you with the instructions and the code you need to unlock your phone. Another option is using a trusted third-party service. These services can unlock your phone for a fee. It's important to do your research and choose a reputable provider to avoid any scams. They will also need some information from you, including your phone's IMEI number, to process the unlock. Remember, while these methods are totally legal and ethical, it's essential to check the terms and conditions of your phone contract and ensure you're not breaching any agreements with your carrier. Stay tuned for more tips and tricks on managing your mobile device effectively. Thanks for sticking with us through the guide. If you found it helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more useful content. And if everything worked out smoothly for you, or if you've got any questions, drop us a comment below. We love hearing from you and are here to help with any hiccups along the way. Until next time, take care.